I'm just in one of those moods today. What am I talking about? Dev Diary, new episode. Jonathan Perez here from johnperez.me, devtomill.com, surefirewebservices.com, etc., 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 etc. Today I am talking about sales. Talk about energy, right? I haven't even had my coffee yet. <laughs> if you're part of the Devonaires, we're having an awesome coffee conversation as well. So I'm about to have my Nespresso. Just a little heads up, side note. But sales, guys, sales, 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 sales. Are we doing it? How often do we do it? And what's going on with it? How do you even sell? Here's what I am coming to find out. That most people don't sell. They sit and they wait. They wait for leads. They wait for, um, they just wait for someone to contact them. And in this age, I think that's a very common thing. We're very digital. We email. We um, we text. We don't call. We, you know, we write and we wait. I will be honest. That is what I've done, and it has worked very well. <laughs> but that's what I did as my side hustle, which was awesome because I didn't need immediate income. I didn't need immediate revenue streams. So what I could do was focus on my different content strategies and focus on different ways to expose myself, giggity, expose myself to the web world, to the industry that I wanted to be found in. Um, that extra time without needing that, that revenue to pay my bills, uh, helped me get a lot of exposure in the Genesis community in uh, Beaver Builder through my own um, Facebook stuff and my own social tryings. Um, and it worked out well because that content eventually started to bring in leads and those leads turned into clients and a lot of those clients I still have today. But when you actually rely on the money to pay your mortgage, you really can't just sit and wait for people to come. It's I've been saying this, I think this is like a theme that I've been saying uh, for a few videos now. It's that balance between, you know, marketing yourself, uh, selling, you know, doing your strategies, putting time towards your own projects versus doing the work that you have to do. And it's it's hard to find that balance. But the bottom line is if you are trying to get that revenue in, you can't really just sit and wait for someone to contact you unless you've established something already. So a little bit of establishing authority, a little bit of establishing credibility with your blog contents and your posts, but a lot of it is just going out, going out, calling somebody, reaching out to your network, following up on Twitter, following up on emails, looking at past clients, looking at past leads that came in, um, Engaging on Facebook, finding someone that you want to work with, looking at Indeed.com or Monster.com, finding people who need jobs, LinkedIn, and actually going forward and reaching out and selling, cold call, cold email, introduce yourself, and do that so that you can actually engage and start to increase your network and meet some new people. My beautiful wife just walked in. <laughs> So that's it, guys. Do that. You guys rock. That's my dev diary for today. That's what I'm focusing on. Work, content, and sales. You guys rock.